Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome to another vlog, welcome to another video. Let me give a big shout out to all my subscribers. Thank you so much for your, your support. I, I really appreciate it. And uh, if this is your first time watching my channel, um, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, come and join the family. Become an auntie, uncle, a cousin. And if you don't want to be a relative, that's fine. You can be a family friend. All I'm asking you to do is just to click on the subscribe button. Click and subscribe. Turn on your post notification bell so that you won't miss an upload uh, as soon as I post the video. Also, I'm asking you to like. Put a thumbs up on the video. It's very important for you to like and share. And you can leave a comment if you like the content that I'm putting out on these videos for you. All right, so welcome to my kitchen. As you know, I'm... I'm always cooking, so it's a nice fall day uh, today. You know, the summer is over. Things are cooling, cooling off a bit, right? Uh, the season, pool season is over. The long winter is coming. So uh, I'm going to, I'm going to do, I'm going to cook some pumpkin soup uh, today. All right. So I want you to follow the process. Right. If you are, if you are married, pumpkin soup is good. If you are single, it is still good. If you are a student, pumpkin soup is really good. It, it it sets it off. Not only that, but it's also it's also flu season, and nothing beats the flu like a good bowl of soup, pumpkin soup. All right. So just watch the process. Now I'm gonna make my pumpkin soup with uh, with beef. Right. So I have some beef shank uh, here all right so let me just take it out of the container take out the bone here so I'm not gonna do much talking all right I'm just cleaning up my my beef right now I'm just taking off the fat of the beef Right? I don't like to cook with meat, meat fat at all. All right, so just like this, right? I have my, my beef cut in small pieces. Or should I say not so small? And I'm just taking off the the excess fat. You know, some people will tell you, well, don't take it off, but I don't cook with the fat at all. So my meat is washed and I'm going to, I'm going to put it in the pressure cooker a bit. All right. So, um, I know some of you would prefer to just put it on and cook it, but I don't have the time to sit and wait for it to, to cook. So I'll put it in the pressure cooker. I'll pressure it for about 10, eight, eight minutes, eight to 10 minutes. So I'll just let that pressure for about eight to 10 minutes. And then, you know, we can start the, 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 the cooking process. So folks, while my, while my beef is on the fire, uh, cooking I'm going to prepare the the pumpkin now this is a Jamaican pumpkin I got this at the West Indian store right for those of you who are not West Indian again I, I got this at the West Indian store all right so I don't use the Halloween pumpkin sorry I use the real stuff to make my my pumpkin soup 
all right so I just take out the the inside take off the skin Right, so let's give it a wash, let it cook. So guys, my pumpkin is, is, is now cooked. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to, I'm going to blend it into a puree. Right, this is, this is how I normally do it. For the richness. Nice puree. Just like that, right? It's rich, creamy puree. All right, let me hope you can see that. Look at that. Awesome. So I just put that right back in the pot. All right. So let me bring you over so that you can see what is happening in the pot here. You can see the, the richness of the pumpkin, very yellow, all right? So that's how I do it. So let that boil for a bit. So guys, I'm now ready to, to put in my, my dumpling. Um, if you don't know how to make dumplings, please go and watch the, the video that I, that, I, that I posted where I made the curry chicken. I served that with, with dumplings and I gave, I gave the step-by-step the -step how to make dumplings, all right? So uh, my dumpling is already made, all right? So I'm going to put that in the pot. Now for the soup, I don't normally do the round ones. I do the, the spinners as they would call it, just like this. All right, so you just go ahead and uh, make a few of these. Very easy, guys. You just break a piece, rub it in your hand, the spinners. And what is soup without spinners? So now that my dumplings are in, I'm about to put in my, my yellow yam. Again, I get this at the West Indian store. And guys, I'm going to tell you, Yellow yam is so expensive, it's unbelievable. Six dollars and fifty cents per pound for yellow yam. Six dollars and fifty cents. This is ridiculous. This is crazy. I don't know man, the price of of food, the price of things is just too high. Alright, but so much for my ranting. And sometimes you buy the yam. It's not even good. But I always ask them to check it and make sure it is, it is good, all right? Not bad, eh? All right, so you want to peel it. Alright, so just wash and be careful guys with the washing because it will 
scratch your hand or make your hand itch. Scratch itch, which one? Right, so I'm just putting in, basically I'm putting in everything that I, that I need at this point. I have my Chocho, Chayot, uh, Christophine, whatever name you call it. And then you want to cut this in small, in small pieces, right? Small cubes. So I just put that in the pot. So guys, I'm gonna put in the rest of my, my vegetables, right? Now there you have it. I have my carrot. I also have my, my scallion or green onion. Let me just give it a wash. I have some thyme, fresh thyme, herb, and I have a, a seasoned pepper. So I'm just gonna put everything in the pot. That's the idea of soup, it's one pot, right? I just let everything infuse. I have my, my soup mix. This is pumpkin soup. Can you see that? And this is Home choice, Jamaica pumpkin soup, right? We also have another one here, right? This is uh, cock soup. Um, nothing suggestive here, please, right? So um, it's, uh, it's, it's soup mix. So I'm gonna put in my, my beef now. Uh, cook. I want that to just infuse with the with the seasoning. Don't worry, I soon bring you over so that you can you can see what is happening over here. Some corns here. I bought them fresh corns today. It's uh, three dollars for ten. So I'll just cut them into, just put these in the pot. Now we're gonna add salt to taste. Now the reason I say salt to taste, you have to be careful because the soup mix already has salt in it, right? So you don't want to over salt your, your, your pot, so you salt the taste. So just be careful. So I won't tell you to put, you know, a tablespoon or two tablespoons. Uh, just be careful because the soup mix already have salt, as I've said before, all right? So I know you can't wait to see what is happening over here, but just look at this. Rich in color. You can see the corn just look at that I hope you can and guys if you can if you smell it I'm telling you awesome I'm just gonna let this cook and then I will show you my finished product who wants some soap <laughs> man this is nice Anybody want soup? Okay guys, so there you have it. I'm all done, finish. Look at the presentation, look at the richness. All right, real authentic Jamaican pumpkin soup. All right, so please, man, if you, if you could just smell, if you could just smell the aroma coming from this. 
awesome all right guys so like i've shown you the presentation i'm just gonna go try it look at this very nice wow awesome awesome guys awesome mm. man i know you're feeling jealous I know you're really feeling jealous, but this is really good. Good for the weather. Good for flu. <laughs> right? But if you could just if you could just taste it, right? My yellow yam. Mm -hmm. Have a sample of my dumpling. So thank you very much for watching thank you so much all right so please go ahead and follow my method follow my recipe for the good jamaican pumpkin soup pumpkin beef soup and uh, let me know how it turned out all right please leave a comment in the comment section and uh, please remember to subscribe like and share all right if you are new if you're if you're new to the channel i need you to subscribe right i need you to put a thumbs up like the video and share it with your family and friends like i have said in the beginning you can become an uncle you can become an aunt a cousin and if you don't want to be a relative that's fine you can be a family friend we welcome you right it's mdtd stay tuned god bless you until the next video